Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Sagittarius Sun Moon and Rising Sign. I want to thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibrations. And um, to each and every person out there, I'm wishing you really a wonderful month because this month is going to be a month of justice. Okay, it's the month of April 2019. It's going to be justice, unbalancing of karma, and that sort of a situation. So be aware of what is transpiring. Okay, don't take it too personal because all the sorry, just about everyone is feeling this. So let's look and see what is coming up for you, Sagittarians. You have the energy of the star coming in. Um, this is really wonderful, and this is positive because what this is saying is that there is an alignment of spirit guides that is going to be working in your favor in the first week. Let's see what we have. We see in the second week a new journey. I am seeing that the energy of whatever is transpiring it's going to give, be giving you this wonderful new start and this wonderful new start is going to be taking you to a higher level okay energy of the tower is here so something is unexpected in the third week is going to be living your life and the um, transformation is coming in but the success is what is going to be coming up for you guys okay so let's go and see what is transpiring as we look at uh, these um, energies is that some of you are going to be guided and some of you some surprising unexpected luck in the first and second week last week things are going to be coming to an end and you're going to be successful so for the Sagittarius Sun Moon and Rising Sign, for the first and second week, what exactly is going to be happening? The energy of the magician, lesson you said, oh, people are seeing your value now. Things is about to happen for you guys. So, in the third and last week, the energy of the tower. So we have uh, um, here twice here the tower, fire, and water. Okay, so expect, especially in the third week, something unexpectedly is going to change your life. So, we're asking the agent of guides of the Sagittarians so what is going to be affecting the Sagittarius in the third and last week, the night of ones, the night of ones. So, this is wonderful. So, you, um, young men, between the ages of 18 and 45, you be aware of what you're doing. Because there is something unexpectedly going to be leaving your life. Okay, so you men between the ages of 18 and 45 in the last week of April, something unexpectedly is about to leave your life. Be aware of the situation. Okay, be aware of the situation. As we look at the second week with this new start that is coming up for the Sagittarius, second week of the April, what is happening is that whatever your financial stability is, you're going to be overcoming this, okay? Whatever that was transpiring and affecting your financial stability, you're definitely going to be overcoming this. And the energy of the, the um, new energy is coming in and it's going to be giving you a new start to move forward. So, this is really, really, really a month where. You're going to be returning. Your energy is going to be returning. End of the month, you're so tired. You need to have some rest, you sages. Justice prevail. Bam. And this is the energy vibration of the month. And justice prevail in this month because of an unjust situation that has transpired. So Congratulations to you, Sagittarius. Whatever the unbalance, whatever the situation is, justice prevail because there is going to be some investigation, whether it is uh, um, in a legal sense or and not a legal sense. Whatever it is, there is going to be some investigation, and someone is going to be coming forward to shed light. So you, uh, people between the age of eighteen and forty-five, whatever you're doing, the last. We the third week and last week is, is, is you know be careful you Sagittarius 
between the ages of 18 and 45 because it's third week or last week trust the justice is coming down on you and they're going to be throwing the book at you so you need to be careful so when we're looking at this for the rest of you guys is that if you have been dealing with some injustice situation in your life in the last week um, you know be careful because some transition is going to be coming in so the energy of the star and the magician is very good because that is as if if you were having some financial situation somehow out of the blue something unexpectedly is going to be happening for you you guys are going to be very tired at the end of the month extremely extremely tired what I'm seeing happening is that again you people between the ages and need all not all of you take what is for you and take what is not for you if you were have done something injustice or illegal you're watching your back because you know you have done something deceptive so you someone is also justice they're on they're investigating you men are women between the ages of 18 and 45 so um you're moving and you're trying to find a new start but there is you know there is so much you're you're so tired and that is for the young people for the rest of you there's a transition month as a very successful month in the sense that your energy is going to be back some of you are going to be finding your vitalizing your energy back and things are going to be really working out for you guys in a good positive way the star and the magician will and these are all ear signs the star and the magician and a new start is an all ear sign and um some people is going to be help, receiving help from people in powers but some people are going to be receiving help from their parents so some of you your parents could be in the, in the spirit world that is going to be helping you with a situation in the first and second week okay the second week going in the third week we have some of you are moving forward and something unexpectedly is going to be removed out of your life and then the energy of the sun is going to be coming in which is bringing balance so the second week going in the third week something is finally something someone some situation issues have now been resolved and unexpectedly removing out of your life and there the long-term stability is going to be coming in to you and this was a karmic situation so for the people between the age of 18 and 45 who are going through a karmic situation you have done something or some of you are just going through a karmic situation but Whatever this karmatic situation is that you were going through, definitely you needed to go through this um, so that you could come out at, at a stronger place. You were dealing with some blocks with your financial situation, and it caused by people in, in the wrong way, people who use their power in the wrong way. But it's going to be coming, it is going to be releasing. So we're going to be, you know, to find out what is going to be happening, and this is going to be happening in the second week because. In the second week, some of you are going to be moving, looking for long-term stability, but then there is something that is going to be happening. There is some of you um, between the ages of 18 and 45 is being watched, okay? Um, and it is, it's some of you could be in protective uh, or being protected, but some of you are being watched. And so it says that, uh, um, especially the young people, the young folks, uh, some of you could be watched. Now, let's see what is the outcomes. The outcomes is the energy of the star. So, you have twice the star in your reading. This means that it's going to be a, a good month. Um, there's hope. You need to return and find inner wisdom, hope, hope to a situation because whatever the situation that you're going through, especially when you're financial situation you you need to focus and have hope that things will happen for you okay um the five of pentacles comes out twice for you guys and um, here it is the five of pentacles i was just about to ask a question about the five of pentacles so um we're going to be asking what is this message about the five of pentacles 
um, the Three of Cups uh, celebration over and seeing the truth of the situation. Okay, you could happen in the second week. That a block, you're going to be finding out why your financial situation was blocked. And this comes, some of you are going to be finding out that people have worked negative energies are, are against you to block your financial situation. But whatever has happened and whatever that has transpired, it's as if whoever has done that is being um, um, investigated. Okay, whoever has done that is being investigated. Now the five of pentacles comes up and the energy of the block. Now there is some celebration um, that has to do with your say something that has transpired against you, and it has to do with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. And this is all coming out. So an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, and justice is going to come down on her. An Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. I did something to block your financial stability. Let's see if this block what is about. It's something to do with work and a new start. And whoever is this Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra, there is the cloud and a secret is going to be coming out about her. So there is this Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra that has done something. Justice is going to be coming down on them very 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 hard and the situation at work and then you start at a friend so some of you at work is going to be receiving a new start but not only that you're going to be also receiving help from a friend someone at work is going to become a friend i really 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 cares and 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 Honestly, deeply care um, for you. And the energy of the block. I don't like this when this. Well, it's a message that we are. But the outcomes is that you are going to be um, very. There is going to be a, a positive outcomes that is going to be coming in for you guys. A very positive outcomes that is going to be coming in for you guys. Okay, and especially at work. Um, you're going to be receiving a new start of work, and you're going to be receiving also help from someone at work, and this is going to be good. Alrighty, not a bad reading um, for you guys. For the extended of this reading, please um, connect. I'm seeing some success because um, justice is going to be coming down against an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Whoever this um, lady is, um, justice is going to be coming down against her. Now we're going to be looking at the spirit energy that comes out for you guys and we have card one and card two please you can't choose both cards you have to choose one because these are your spirit guide that is going to be helping you to move forward if you choose card one it is the spirit of the dove be at peace number 21 so it's the end of a situation and uh, they want you to be at peace so if you choose card one it is the energy of the dark and it's number 21 and they want you to be at peace and this is going to be very very good then we have card two and it came up in the um the reverse and they're uh, they're saying that some of you this energy by you is reverse time for um a beginner's mind okay so um this energy when you turn it around it is um, four and eight is um, 12 and number 12 is the infinite the um, body mind so um, 12 one plus two is three so it was in the reverse which is as if you're release yourself from everything around you and it was the reverse and now we're looking at it upright, okay? And as we look at it upright, we're going to try and understand that we need to connect, reconnect with the body, mind, and soul, because some of us are, are released from the body, mind, and soul, and they want us to basically connect with the body, mind, and soul, okay? Activation card, it is the root chakra. The root chakra, this is your financial abundance. And that's why the energy of the Five of Pentacles comes up twice because there is a situation where the five of pentacles um 
you were blocked you were just blocked okay and now you need to heal the root chakra and you need to stay from hum from hum hum okay and release and focus on this energy and it's at a frequency of the root chakra the red flowers of life stimulate passion and support our um, sense of security on the physical plane both in our bodies and in the physical world so some of you could be having block root chakras uh, and that is the reason why it came up okay ladies and gentlemen I want to say thank you please like share these videos and as you like and share these videos you are going to be receiving positive energies that is coming out and it's going to be helping you I'm seeing long-term stability um, whoever is about to do a new start in this month there's going to be long-term stability and you're going to be regaining your strength coming in um, this month some of you could have some financial problems but it's as if someone at work is going to be helping you out and this is going to be good whatever secret there was um, you're going to be very lucky because whatever the secret was kept um, from you luck some luck is going to be coming in and some of you could have had a book and this book um, is going to be helping you to get out of a situation okay so a book that you have written can be a success and it can be a luck that some somehow you're being helped via this book because this book um, is what have, um, really 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 helped you out of a situation if you decide to um, publish a book it is good to go ahead and publish the book it's going to be a, a success the star comes out twice so a lot of you your spirit guides are going to be helping you but the star is also hope and fate and it is also expect unexpected surprises this is going to be good obviously a lot of things are going to be ending justice is here. Um, 